AIM Exclusive has gone beyond my expectations by traveling over 100 miles to repair a printer at our remote office. We were looking for another service provider because uh, sometimes uh, repairs and maintenance weren't happening uh, for several days. So we took a look uh, around at a couple of other vendors and uh, found AIM Exclusive, tried them out, and we're very pleased. There have been several times when a technician has stayed late to uh, break down a printer, so to speak, to make sure that it was functional the next day, uh, or to come to off-site printers, whether it's at uh, our suburban office or home offices, to make sure that things were working well. Um, and uh, that level of service is something that we value. We have uh, approximately 200 uh, network printers on five floors. We have about 100 and plus uh, local printers on the, on the five floors as well. Uh, we've had, we just replaced printers that have been in service since the early 90s and they were used every day and the only reason we were replacing them was because people just, you know, oh it's dirty, and, you know, I want a new one. So, and the new ones have a lot more features and stuff, but Glenn and his crew kept those things running. We have, you know, printers at over two million page counts. Well, I will say that there was a printer that we had one of my associates was using, and uh, they the AM exclusive came in and replaced, um, I think it's called the roller, and then some uh, gears, and they were working pretty hard on the machine. They were here a couple of times, and uh, finally the, they um, it still wasn't working to our satisfaction, so they just took the whole printer out and replaced it. So I thought that was uh, pretty impressive. We were told to use this other vendor, which um, reluctantly we did, we had such a great relationship with uh, you know Glenn and Vicky and everybody. Um, after three or four months of using this other company, we all went, and there was about eight of us at the time, uh, to a corporate and said we will no longer use them, and they had better get uh, Glenn on site and Rob on site again because uh, what was happening was when we were getting printer repairs, we were winding up having to go and redo them. I spent four or five hours with the person. Uh, trying to tell him how to do his job whereas when you know the text from A&M come in it's okay here's the problem you know they look at the sheet of paper and can tell by the printout that you know what the issue is and it's oh no problem I'll be back go down to the truck get a part these guys they were like uh, we don't have to get the part and we don't know what to do and it was really a hassle so we fought hard to get him back which we have had him back for a couple of years now and it's the same as it was if not better